Well, this weekend, Dateline Schools, we're talking about Meet Up, Eat Up. It's a summer lunch program that's made available to students here in St. Clair County. And tell us more about it. My special guest is the Director of Food and Nutrition Services for Port here in Schools. And, and Mary, is this type of program also offered at other school districts around the county? Or is it just in Port Huron that's offering it this year? Yes, it's, it's offered um, across the state. Um, we have been consistent. Um, I've been doing it for 30 years. I've been here. So Port Huron's really been committed to providing meals to the students in the summer. And some of the other school districts do it, but um, not, as, not as consistent as Port Huron. Yeah, I was going to say, yeah, it seems to me that uh, you've done a, a, a huge service to the community for several years doing that. As a result, are you finding the need is greater now than it has been in past years? Yes, we. Um, I've already received calls wondering where they can find the menu, um, where are the programs going to be at, and it is already online. So, you know, we answer those questions and let them know where they can find that information. But yes. And again, you don't have to have a child in the summer school program to take advantage of this. That's correct. If you're a grandparent and your grandchildren are visiting for the week, you can look it up online and take them to any of the sites, make it a little field trip, go there and have them have lunch, go out and play on the swings and make a, you know, afternoon of it. Um, and you don't even have to be school aged children. If you are a parent of a two and three year old and you want to take them to have lunch, bring them in to any of the sites and they can have lunch with us. What time are you typically uh, serving the meals this year? Um, at the elementary level, it's 8.45 to 9.15 for breakfast, and lunch is 11.30 to 12 at all of our sites. Great. Well, that 8.15, it's got to be a little bit better than having to be at school before 7 o'clock, right? That's right. That's, <laughs> so right. that's good. And, and this has to be kind of a win-win for your staff, too, because didn't they typically only work during the school year or had summers off like teachers? Yes. Absolutely. We have a lot of staff that were very excited that they have opportunity to bid on a position and that they have another six weeks of work and, um, you know, keeps them staying, staying in our program and coming back in the fall. So Great. we'll be back with more tomorrow for Daylight Schools. I'm Terry Harris.